In this tutorial, we'll show how to use DeLeaker in order to find some leaks in QCreator. DeLeaker is a developer tool created to find memory leaks, GDI leaks, leaks of handles. It is available as a standalone application, but also can be integrated with popular IDEs such as Visual Studio and Rad Studio. New version of DeLeaker can work as a QCreator plugin. Let's have a look how it works. Run the installer. It detects installed QCreator versions. Let's run QCreator. New menu DeLeaker has been added. Let's click the menu. This one is to show the DeLeaker window. The next one, to view DeLeaker options. The following one is to disable or enable the plugin. Let's open the DeLeaker window. Here is the Options button. You can enable or disable DeLeaker right here. Let's close it for now and create a new project to look how DeLeaker detects leaks. Choose Cute Widgets application. Type in the project's name and change its location. Keep the Kit Selection page the same. Keep the Class Information page as it is. The same for Project Management page. Click to finish. Great! The project is ready! Let's write some code and add a button. Now let's introduce a leak, allocating one instance of Q push button. Imagine that someone allocated Q push button, but then decided not to add it to a layout. Now let's build and run. The application is running. Close the window. Once the application is exited, the leaker starts taking snapshot. OK, snapshot is ready. We can review it. There are some allocations made by Qt libraries. Fortunately, the leaker can filter allocations by module. Let's select the application's executable file. Now you can see our leak. Source file and exact line number are shown. Call stack is available. Let's walk the call stack. DeLeaker is tightly integrated with Qt Creator. It's very easy to locate any kind of leaks, including memory leaks, GDI leaks, leaks of handles. For each allocation, a full call stack is available. You can take a snapshot any moment while process is running, compare the snapshots to find exact lines in the code that are permanently leaking. Also, DeLeaker takes a final snapshot when a process exits. Happy coding!